the extra business extravaganza at the Genesis Center in Calgary. We are selecting some few entrepreneurs who have done an amazing job in building a successful business in Calgary. So at this moment we have with us Stush Joseph, who has been building a business for 26 years and he's transitioned the business from, from music CDs to beauty and hair supplies. So, Mr. Joseph, thank you for talking to Diversity TV, Diversity Magazine, Diversity Online. So tell us, what, what were you doing before uh, you transitioned into beauty and hair and beauty products? Well, I used to be in the, um, the music business, like DJing and, and um, fixing um, electronic stuff and so on. And, um, also, I was a cook in a restaurant and stuff like that. And so a lot of things. I would do a lot of different things. So I see you have your brochure with lots of products. How did you get into this business? Well, I was Island Beat was um, a record shop, and as years passed by, um, the records is fading out and stuff like that. CDs coming in and people burning their own stuff, and then. I start talking to other people and so on, and especially women, and they said to start carrying some beauty products and beauty supplies and so on, and hair extensions and so on, and that's when I got into it and gradually growing and get, get into it, and it's been a success. Yeah, and you transition from music to, from hair, music product. to hair products. And you started with 800 square feet now to 6,000 square feet. To, to 6,000 square feet. That's yeah. an amazing success. Oh, yeah. And you are from Antigua. I'm from Antigua and Barbuda. When did you come to Canada? 1981. Okay. And how has the journey been since then? Oh, it's good, good, very good. Yeah, I, you know, I came here, I think I worked, worked from, um, like, you know, out here with other people for me about five, six years and I started doing my own thing and be an entrepreneur and so on. So the journey is yeah. good. Any other thing you want to tell our audience? Well, I remember when I opened up my store first, and I remember I had forty-five hundred dollars, and I said I want to be a businessman. And people used to laugh at me and say, "Oh, yeah, right, forty-five hundred dollars." I said, "No, I can do it. I can do it." And that was like nineteen ninety-three. And now, you know, when people see me, they now they shocked to see that I do so much. And, and now you have six thousand square feet, six thousand square feet, five five employees. Yeah, and then. Um, I also have a beauty salon. Oh. I have a barber shop, oh. and you know, and I also have um, a gym in the same building and stuff like that. So you have a hair complex. Yeah, and then um, at the next side I have a, a African store where um, so guys from a couple from our Senegal. They have an African store there. They sell beauty, um, food, and and drums and different arts and crafts and stuff like that. So, yeah. Thank you for your time. No problem. Keep dreaming, keep working hard.